Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Toppers World. This video is about a mock test that is I'm going to conduct with Miss Shivani. She recently appeared in IELTS exam and got 7.5 and in IELTS speaking test. Today we are going to conduct a mock test. I'm very thankful to Shivani because she has uh, she's agreed to spend some valuable time for this mock test. So let's start a mock test of speaking with Miss Shivani. Okay, uh, my name is Praveen Kumar and I'm going to conduct IELTS speaking test. So are you ready? Yes, sir. So what is your name? Myself Shivani and you can call me by my first name as Shivani. Shivani, what do you do? Job or study? I am a student. Currently, I had completed my senior secondary education from medical stream. And where are you from? Well, I was born and brought up in a small town, Kadia, which is located in Punjab. Okay. So Shivani, uh, the part one is about social media and my first question is which social media websites do you use? Well, I think nowadays there are plethora of websites which I used and one of them is Instagram. I usually prefer to use this website because it is very good as I gain a lot of knowledge from this app and moreover whenever I want to communicate with my friends which are living far from me, I used to chat with them. Very good. Second question is how much time do you spend on social media sites? Well, it's very hard for me to say the time. Um, I think I usually spend half an hour on Instagram because uh, as my schedule is very busy and I think we should give more time to our study rather than using these kind of websites. So that's why I usually prefer to use half an hour in this app. Uh, what kind of information about yourself have you put on social media? Well, I don't like to put uh, my information on social media because I'm a kind of person who don't really like to share my views and about myself on social media. And I'm a very private person and I remained in myself only. So that's why I just put some videos of mine, but my account is private. Mm -hmm. Is there anything you don't like about social media? Well, yes, there are a lot of things which I don't like about social media and I think we can't trust on social media, first of all. Like uh, sometimes we get false information about on the social media and sometimes uh, some people hack their account as well. And there are uh, unusual knowledge which uh, children especially get and it affects uh, their uh, psychology and that's why I don't like uh, too much social media. Okay, the last question is, which social media platforms do you mostly love to use and why? Mm, well, I uh, mostly uh, like to use the WhatsApp because it helps me to communicate with my friends and with my family members as well as uh, sometimes I do video conferencing with them and it's just like uh, whenever I talk to my friends, it just rejuvenate my mind and I feel very happy. So that's why WhatsApp is one of them. Okay, in part two, I'm going to give you a cue card. This is about something you like very much, which you bought for your home. Okay. And you have one minute's time to plan this. And after that, I will tell you when to speak and when to stop. So this is your cue card. Okay, start. Well, I am a well-organized girl and I love to organize all the things in my home as well as of my room also. And uh, I want that my room is always being tidy. And uh, yes, I think I bought a lot of things for my room to uh, make it nice. But here I would like to talk about a thing which I liked very much, which I bought for my home and especially uh, for my own personal room. Uh, well, um, I remember that uh, recently I went to Rajasthan uh, from, uh, 
past my vacations and there I saw a mirror and I liked that mirror very much because there were a lot of stones which was uh, uh, outside the mirror and the mirror was very pretty and it was very attractive and firstly when I saw the mirror I just got uh, so fascinating towards it and then I concerned to my mom that I wanted to buy that uh, mirror for my room and then uh, she gave, gave me the permission and uh, this was the mirror which was rectangular in shape and it was about uh, 4 cm in width and 2 to 3 cm long and it was a very beautiful mirror and I choose this particular thing because I want uh, to make my room more pretty and I think mirrors are one of them which makes everything very pretty shiny as well that's why I decided to uh, buy this thing and uh, I liked it very much because uh, whenever I wanted to go for outside I usually prefer to watch at this mirror and it uh, also boosts up my confidence also so that's why this is the thing in my home even in my room which i like the most thank you okay so the cue card uh, is well sent but there are few mistakes committed by her actually this is purely organic mock test no preparations were done in advance and uh, the one point was that uh, where she mentioned the dimensions of the mirror like two three centimeter this is too small it should be 20 centimeter by 30 centimeter like this 2-3 cm something is very small and we cannot see the face through it and the second thing is the stones uh, were outside the mirror this is I think again a not proper word has been used over there it should be like that the stones were fixed at the boundary of the mirror yeah, all the four corners of the mirror fixed or embedded or uh, glued there you can use such kind of verbs over there ok it doesn't matter it's a it's minor mistakes which are done by the many candidates even the students who get 8 band they also make grammatical mistakes and uh, this is just the part of uh, you know flow with the flow we just go and make mistakes so need not to worry about Shivani next question is uh, creating a nice home why do some people buy lots of things for their home well, I think nowadays uh, there is a trend to make their home more nice and beautiful and they prefer to buy more and more things for their home because they want to make their home more organized and uh, they also uh, get some comments from outsiders also that your home is so pretty and well. So that's why in these cases people like to prefer to buy more and more beautiful things for their home. I think uh, compliment is better word. Uh, as compared to the comments do you think it is very expensive to make a home look nice um well it's totally depend upon once that uh, how many budget she or he can uh, take over it and uh, well nowadays yes it's quite uh, harder or expensive to make uh, a beautiful uh, to make uh, a beautiful home because I think that nowadays as um, uh, technology is increasing day by day so with it I can say that uh, the cost is also increasing day by day of everything so that's why I think that it's quite difficult hmm. it's not uh, how many budget I think how much budget one has many and much uh, are two different uh, adjectives many is used when things are countable and much is used when things are not countable, uncountable. So instead of saying many budget, uh, much budget is much better. And uh, why, okay, technology is increasing. Instead, it should be that technology is advancing or technology is developing. Increasing word is not suitable with technology. Increasing use of technology can be said why don't some people care about how their home looks well i can say that it's totally depend upon their financial condition if uh, i think in india there are many people who are not financially strong who are poor and uh, these kind of people don't think about their home because they uh, fulfill their uh, needs their daily basis needs like food shelter so i don't think that they have uh, much money to give uh, uh, to, to spend on, to their, spend home. on their home hmm. okay the next part is different types of home 
in what ways is living in a flat apartment or apartment better than living in a house well i think uh, in different ways uh, living in apartment is quite better than living in home uh, the first one is that uh, in home sometimes we shouldn't uh, follow the rules and regulations but when we live in the flat or apartment we came to know about the rules and regulations and we should become more punctual as well as more uh, follow the rules and regulations moreover i think that nowadays as land is not um, as land is decreasing because most of the people prefer to build new factories as well so it's quite better to take land or to spend money on land rather so it's quite difficult to spend uh, money on land so it's quite better to live in flat or apartment hmm. so making own house is very expensive it requires a lot of money investments instead living in a flat on a rental basis or buying the flat is much better option than living in a house so nice answer do you think homes will look different in the future yes i can say that as per future is unpredictable but uh, i can see that uh, homes will look different in the future one of the reason is that uh, by increasing in the technology uh, more and more things are come which makes the home more beautiful and nice and i think instead of using any kind of brick or all these cements or raw materials the homes uh, would be a mirrors home and uh, there would be more technologies and they are air conditioners home so i think that these changes may be takes place in the future okay uh, the answer is uh, not very much satisfying from my point of view uh, i think uh, there would be changes in future uh the material that we are using nowadays that might not be available in future or people may use more cost effective materials as technology is advancing many new kind of materials like fiberglass for example i think this is going to revolutionize the way of construction of houses uh in future the houses would be energy saving a uh, light in weight and much cheaper compact and uh, it, they would be easily uh, movable if a person decide to change the location he can uh, fold his house and move to any other location and uh, install his house once again over there so there would be many, many changes as but one thing i like uh, she said that is unpredictable so that are the changes i am predicting it's not necessary that that will take place but we just can make some predictions regarding this Do you agree that the kinds of homes people prefer change as they get older? The kind of okay. Let me read the question once again. Do you agree that the kinds of homes people prefer change as they get older? Well, yes, of course, uh, because people want to update day by day. So they wanted that their home in which they are living uh, will also get changed uh, one day. And I think yes. Uh, preferably a uh, people would like to live in more beautiful and more comfortable home rather than in the past home which are not comfortable as well as which do not provide comfort to them yes so change is the law of nature the people's taste keep on changing as people are getting older they want more comfortable houses they want such houses in which they can walk they can grow some plants greenery fresh oxygen more lights they can take sun bath so as people are growing aged uh, their taste and their needs and wants also get changed so thank you shivani uh, having a wonderful mock test and it's a great experience so friends uh, i would like to uh, advise you that uh, whenever you go for ielts speaking it's very very important for you to make eye contact uh, in the beginning the eye contact was missing with my candidate here Uh, this is very natural because when we start speaking we are a bit nervousness but you know as the conversation progresses and warms up the eye contact level get naturally maintained the first two three questions like what is your name where are you from these are just warm up questions and you are not going to get any score for these kind of questions the scoring starts from the part 1 part 2 part 3 So thank you for watching this video I hope that this video would be of a great advantage to you keep watching my channel stay tuned stay healthy thank you bye bye